We're here today at the Dryden floor plan by Lifestyle Builders and Developers. This plan has been built in the Scotts Landing neighborhood in Hanover County. It's a first floor master plan with an additional full guest suite uh, downstairs. Another two bedrooms up for a total of four bedrooms. It's uh, almost 3,800 heated square feet, three car garage. And uh, as you can see, we've done this with a very European uh, flare on the front elevation. We're going to take a trip inside and check it out. As we arrive in the foyer area here at the Dryden, you're going to see uh, a lot of hardwoods throughout the first floor here. Uh, nice tray ceiling detail here uh, accenting the, the foyer. And off to the left on the other side of the decorative column here you can see the dining room, again with a tray ceiling, nice crown molding details, wainscoting, and uh, off, uh, back off in the distance you can see the, the stairs headed up. Uh, we'll come back around there in a little bit and a pass through into the kitchen there, which we'll see in greater detail in a minute. To the right of the foyer, through uh, what we, we've done double doors here, into a study can be set up as a living room or a study and uh, then we're going to step in here to the family room and you're going to find uh, very tall ceilings 11 foot ceiling line in here in the family room we've done built-in bookcases here on either side of a, a very nice rustic looking stone fireplace and this opens directly into the kitchen. I'm gonna spin around here so you can get a good look. We've got a, a large center island with the sink there, some display shelves, um, tile backsplash there at the cooktop, and the staggered height cabinets under cabinet lighting, which uh, you can see illuminating the countertop there and uh, stainless steel wall oven uh, with microwave combo and a refrigerator cabinet that's set up to receive the, the future refrigerator there as well. Large breakfast area with a vaulted ceiling. We've trimmed that out with a beadboard detail and put a couple of sloped recessed cans in there. This is a nice um, acreage sized lot. You can see the wooded uh, line in the back the tree line beyond the cleared backyard and here we've done a screen porch on this as well coming right off of the breakfast room that, as you can see on the outside there through the windows and the door and as I spin back we're gonna step through this back hallway short hallway here past the pantry closet on my left and into the owner's suite got uh, corner windows here Another window there. We, so we're getting good natural light in here. Two walk-in closets. There's one and a second one there. So separate closets. And I'm going to spin around here and we're going to get a look at the owner's bath through a set of double doors, tub, uh, set off here to the right. And vanity here double vanity with the drawers, drawers in the middle uh, and a set of drawers on either end. We've done custom frame mirrors here with uh, wall sconce lighting as you can see and a tile shower with body sprays and you can see the frameless glass door set up there and it's got a rain can as well. So a very nice shower, uh, Lastello border detail, really accenting that. We'll pass the water closet there and you can see you've got direct access here into the laundry room directly from the owner's suite. Um, there's the laundry hookups here on this wall. And then this passes right back out uh, into the common area. We were there earlier at the front door and I'm going to spin here and show you, uh, we put some coat hooks on the wall here. That's the door from the garage into the house. And another bathroom here. 
with a shower set up and that gives accessibility to this bedroom first floor guest bedroom has got its own access through this door into that same bathroom we'll take a trip upstairs and see what we find up there all right <clears throat> the top of the stairs here as I turn you're gonna find uh, a nice loft area uh, this plan can actually be done with a full owner suite upstairs as well so you can get a a master up and a master down in the same home uh, but we have set this up with secondary bedrooms and a loft here's a good size secondary bedroom here and we've got a full bath here with uh, dual sinks and tub shower combo transom light there at the end to bring in some natural light Another secondary bedroom, and this is a nice feature. Look at all of this unfinished storage space, easily accessible. Uh, all of your holiday uh, goods, sporting equipment, all that kind of stuff can go in here very easily. And uh, just one, one more thing I want to show you here off of the loft area, we've got a media room. Here, uh, it's a, intended to be dark, uh, no windows, uh, set up wired with cable jack and uh, runs to a PVC jumper with an outlet on the wall to, to accept your large screen TV. Uh, great area to hang out, watch movies, football games, uh, and the like. So this is the Dryden by Lifestyle Builders and Developers.